This is the last moments without any braces. This is what my mouth looks like now. Yeah, I have um, like a little overbite, like my mouth, my teeth, top teeth go out and then in. It's kind of complicated. Um, have my bang all the way up here. And I did have more teeth, but the orthodontist had said to get my baby teeth removed and two on the top. Hey guys! So, I'm coming with another video. Oh my gosh, this is my first video with my braces on. And I am so happy that I have braces. I've been wanting braces for years. Like, since middle school, I've wanted braces. But, funds was never in play. And then, prom was coming up. And I worked with it for... 20 years prior 18 years prior that I just was like uh hello I know how to get a smile without you know because my teeth were white so the flaws you really as long as they white like who cares about the flaws I can hide the flaws very well but anyway I finally have my braces and I'm about to share some backstory on the process it took for me to get my braces. Okay, bear with me. <laughs> Alright, so I got my braces on August. It's taking some serious adjustments. So, first, steps leading up to me getting braces. First, I had to go to my dentist. Well, my dentist told me years ago that I needed braces. I knew I needed braces. But anyway, yeah, I went to my dentist, got my cleaning done. And then I went to an orthodontist that I found just searching who's the orthodontist throughout my insurance program. And then doing some own research on my own of, the, of orthodontist. And I found this orthodontist really close to my home. And I went to go visit, and I love the atmosphere. I love the office, how everyone's so nice. Like, the front desk are amazing. Hey, guys are watching. <laughs> but, yeah, so the staff was great. And then I went into the back, had a consultation about my treatment plans. So, my treatment plans was really traditional, or I believe I could get ceramic braces. And hopefully I pronounced that well. And I chose to just get traditional at the time. Because I didn't know. Or also I didn't ask what the other option were exactly. And I just knew like what traditional were. Like, yeah. So, had the whole consultation. And then I got the bill. And... I had to put down a lump sum to get my impressions and my molding. So after I put down the money, I did some research on like impression videos and then braces videos. And I swore I was getting it all done in one day. I don't know why, <laughs> but it's not like that. So I went to get my um molds done. So she took pictures of my teeth smiling and then she put the retractors in and the mirror and we got the top of my mouth, the bottom, sides and then I stood up, got some x-rays done and then I took a profile picture, side side picture, smiling picture and, and the not smiling picture and the profile. And then she took this like laser and went on each tooth and it took a photo of my impressions and I wasn't allowed to record it. I couldn't record it anyway because it was just me there. And then step three, I sat down and I had another consultation in the sort about what my teeth are going to look like after this whole step like he pulled it up on the computer my x-rays and the digital impressions that i was taking of me and then 
like a video played of what my teeth look like now and then what my teeth are gonna look like then like my and then it was like a whole face and like my face was different I was like what that's so awesome and my mom was like all shocked and I was shocked because that was cool like it's really techno technological advanced there the plan is only for two years of me having braces so he told me I need to get my wisdom teeth out <sighs> why I mean I've been going back and forth with my dentist and the orthodontist should I get them out should I not and the orthodontist said it'll be wise because you may get problems in the future and the dentist did say that but she said since you don't have any problems with the wisdom teeth now that as long as you clean it well or cleaning them well then you should be okay and so my mom and I just came up with the decision to get my wisdom teeth removed and I had to wait two weeks after that to get my braces put on. So me when I got a wisdom teeth out I had my mom record my reaction and I swear I didn't know I said half that stuff. And I'm going to insert, oh help me God, a clip of, oh God, of me after I got my wisdom teeth removed. And so, try not to judge me, okay? I was not in the right state of mind. Hmm? This is the cake you Not yet. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's a bathroom around here. Oh, my teeth. What? My teeth. Yeah. This is a messy Huh? This is a messy Yeah. Really? Yeah, everything is done. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. 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 You finished? Huh? Mm -hmm. Two weeks. The first week, um, I had some pain, like my mouth was swollen still. And then the second week was approaching and it was still a little bit of pain, but I was like, I really want my braces. But the doctor there, they told me to wait. So I waited. And then that following week, I was able to get my braces on. And it was really simple. So I went back there and I, she cleaned my teeth, like, kind of like sand my teeth to make sure all, everything was away, like off of my teeth so I could start the process of putting on my braces. And I rinsed my mouth and I sat back down and then the orthodontist came out and he started pitting on each bracket with her assistance. And then I put my, she put my wires on and I picked out a color. So the way I went about picking out my color, because I told you a hundred times I watched videos, was in, I don't know who video it was, but they said black helps like make your teeth appear whiter. So I was like, well, why wouldn't I want that? Like. I do get asked what kind of braces I have if the people see them. Like, I have the traditionals. Straight metal. As you can see. And he did. And he did, um, put, like a feeling in both sides of my teeth because he didn't want me to bite down straight away and he said I'll get comfortable with it but it feels like it's honestly going away because I eat on this side of my mouth because that side it just because of the feeling is so high like it's not comfortable like I can't chew properly on that side so I mean I had to take small bites anyway but I can't even do that on this side I only could chew on one side for the moment so, I hope you enjoyed this video. If, if you're new to my channel, welcome. 
subscribe, give it a big thumbs up. If you have any other questions, let me know in the comments down below, on Instagram, wherever you can reach me. And I'll be sure to answer them. And um, who knows, maybe I'll do a Q&A video. So just let me know. See you in the next video. Bye. shampoo and conditioner at 11 inches left at 11 inches the right side this is the last moments without any braces this is what my mouth looks like now yeah I have um like a little overbite like my mouth my teeth top teeth go out and then in it's kind of complicated um have my bang all the way up here and i did have more teeth but the orthodontist had said to get my baby teeth removed and two on the top hey guys so I'm coming with another video. Oh my gosh, my first video with my braces on. And I am so happy that I have braces. I've been wanting braces for years. Like I went to go visit and I love the atmosphere. I love the office, how everyone's so nice. Like the front desk are amazing. Hey, guys are watching. <laughs> but yeah, so the staff was great. And then I went into the back, had a consultation about my treatment plans so my treatment plans was really traditional or I believe I could get ceramic braces and hopefully I pronounce that well and I chose to just get traditional at the time because I didn't know or also I didn't ask what the other option were exactly and I just knew like what traditional were like yeah so had the whole consultation and then i got the bill and i had to put down a lump sum to get my impressions and my molding so after i put down the money i did some research on like impression videos and then braces videos and i swore i was getting it all done in one day i don't know why <laughs> but it's not like that. So, I went to get my um, molds done. So, she took pictures of my teeth smiling and then she put the retractors in. And... Alright, so I got my braces on August. It's taken some serious adjustment. So, first, steps leading up to me getting braces. First, I had to go to my dentist. Well, my dentist told me years ago that I needed braces. I knew I needed braces. But anyway, yeah, I went to my dentist, got my cleaning done. And then I went to an orthodontist that I found just searching who's the orthodontist throughout my insurance program. And then doing some own research on my own of that of orthodontist and I found this orthodontist really close to my home and I since middle school I wanted braces but funds was never in play and then prom was coming up and I worked with it for 20 years prior 18 years prior that I just was like uh hello I know how to get a smile without you know, because my teeth were white. So, the flaws, you really, as long as they white, like, who cares about the flaws? I can hide the flaws very well. But anyway, I finally have my braces. And I'm about to share some backstory on the process it took for me to get my braces. Okay, bear with me. 